Well, Giles, there's notional figures looking at income and expenditure around the public sector. It gives us a view into Scotland's economy, which, as I say, is improving. And to, to keep improving, we have to make the right decisions and avoid a hard Brexit, because we know the forecast suggests that that will uh, undermine GDP uh, as well as employment. The just figures today show an improving picture for Scotland's economy, deficit down by 10%, our onshore revenues increasing at the fastest rate since these records began. Uh, so it's an improving picture, very much in line with recent data showing record high employment and unemployment lower than the rest of the UK, and recent GDP data showing that our economy is growing at almost four times the rate of the rest of the UK. Well, Aquila is a shining example of the strength of our life sciences sector. Uh, Scotland has got a number of competitive advantages in key growth sectors and, and sectors that are growing worldwide. Life sciences, tourism, creative industries, renewable energy, uh, advanced manufacturing. These are all areas that demonstrate the fundamental strengths of our economy and that's why the Scottish Government with Scottish Enterprise and Highlands and Islands Enterprise are so focused on making sure uh, we build on those competitive advantages.